Hi everyone, I'm Pete Dalladay and welcome to this edition of the Cruise Cam, where we catch up this time around with Pete's forward, Matt Pumple. Matt, good to see you back here at the Memorial Center. I know you wanted to come home uh, with a gold medal, but you got a silver up north uh, at the Under-17 Championships. Just tell us uh, what the whole experience was like for you. Oh, it was an unbelievable experience uh, representing your province and uh, and actually representing Canada in the Final Four. I was the only team that, that made it that far, and it was something special. I think you actually have to, to witness to know to know what it's like. Uh, words can't really explain it, and, and to wear the maple leaf and, and represent something like that, it's it's unbelievable, and you, you can't really you can't describe the feeling you feel. What happened in the final game? Obviously, a low scoring. Uh, was it a tight checking game? Yeah, it was. It was. It was a lot of cycling, and I, I felt that we uh, we really outplayed the the U.S. there, and um, they got a couple more bounces than we did, obviously. But but their goalie played great, and and we can't follow our team. You know, we threw everything at the net, and uh, we just uh, like I think it was just a difference of a bounce, uh, that little skate hits off or something like that. We didn't have that night, and but we can't be disappointed with our effort uh, coming back from losing the first game and uh, and doing that. So we were happy with uh, we're happy with the silver, as, even though it doesn't sound right, but could have been. A a lot worse with not even getting a medal. Absolutely, yeah. Uh, in your own performance, I, I know you chipped in uh, offensively there, and w were a big part of the program. W what do you think of your own game? Uh, I was I was happy with it for the most part. Um, it, it's an adjustment going back to, to playing with your own age. You maybe want to mix it up a little bit and try try to do more than than what you're thinking of or what you're used to. But it was uh, it was a lot of fun, and getting to know all the guys was great. And uh, like I feel I feel we had the best team in the tournament, but uh, just didn't come out on top there. Now uh, another Canadian team that didn't come out on top was was the uh, the junior team, uh, perhaps a team you could be part of in a couple of years or so. But uh, I don't know if you caught last night's game or not. Or what was your reaction to that, knowing sort of what you had just gone through it? Yeah, I, uh, I caught the tail end of it. I was actually at the Leafs game earlier, but it was um, it was it was kind of unsettling to know that that the U.S. is uh, kind of showing us up there. But hopefully they'll get it back next year. And uh, and it was funny actually in our tournament the the outcome was the same way with us with silver and U.S. with gold and Sweden with uh, with the bronze. But but I think they battled hard coming back there at the end. And uh, they just couldn't get that that bounce in overtime that maybe we were looking for late in the third in in our game. It's back to normal now. Uh, it's back to a regular grind uh, here with the Peets. Uh, you obviously want to pick up where you left off. You were really getting into a groove there uh, before you left. Uh, I'm sure you kept a track on, uh, on on the team when you were gone. But uh, your thoughts heading into this game against Mississauga? Yeah, I was listening to to a little bit of your radio, but um, but yeah, I think we we have a strong team here, and we down the stretch here going towards the playoffs. I think we can do something special if we uh, if we all put our minds to it and get and get the job done. And uh, obviously, I just want to come back and uh, contribute as much as I can to help the team out and and uh, hopefully get that top spot back in the division for the uh, for the playoff run. Sounds good, Matt. Thanks very much. Welcome back, and uh, we'll see you Thursday night. Thanks a lot for having me. And that will do it for another edition of the Cruise Cam. I'm Pete Dalladay. Be sure and visit us at www.cruisefm.ca.